The exact nature of Nintendo's next console is still shrouded in mystery, but ever so slowly, concrete details are emerging that are helping us build a picture of what the NX will be like when it launches. During Nintendo's financial results briefing in Japan, the company announced that the NX will launch worldwide in March 2017. Completely missing the Christmas period is an odd choice, but maybe they thought it was wise not to compete with the launch of PSVR and potentially the PS4 Neo as well. Either way, that's less than a year to wait for Nintendo's next console, as long as its launch isn't hit by delays. There's some bad news if you were hoping for a look at the NX at this year's E3 though. According to this press release from Nintendo, the NX will not be shown at the Los Angeles trade show and will instead be unveiled later in the year. The only playable game from the publisher at this year's E3, in fact, will be The Legend of Zelda. The press release also mentioned that The Legend of Zelda would be launching simultaneously for the Wii U and NX, and that both versions of the game have been in development in tandem. This makes The Legend of Zelda the first and only officially confirmed title for the NX. Whether or not it will be a launch title though is yet to be ascertained. Of course, there have been plenty of rumours about potential titles out there. Remakes of Smash Bros. 4, Splatoon and Super Mario Maker have been thrown around NeoGAF on a couple of occasions now, while Destructoid recently posted a rumour that Nintendo were fully funding a Beyond Good and Evil sequel exclusively for the NX. While we still have no idea what the NX will look like, according to Nintendo's new president, Tatsumi Kimishima, it will certainly be something unique and different. Speaking to Time Magazine, he says, I can assure you we're not building the next version of the Wii or Wii U. It's something where we have to move away from those platforms in order to make it something that will appeal. This statement throws up many questions, not least of all being, will the console have a gimmick? There have been many rumoured gimmicks surrounding the NX, the famous oval controller slash touchscreen being one, but this statement suggests a return to a more traditional console. At the very least, we can be sure that the graphical capabilities are on par with the latest consoles from Microsoft and Sony. In fact, it looks very likely that the new chipset for the NX will be provided by AMD, who recently revealed the existence of three new design wins for its semi-custom processor design business. In layman's terms, this basically means that they have designed and sold three brand new custom processor chips for unannounced large-scale projects. At least one of these designs has already been exposed as the processor at the heart of the PS4 Neo, but that leaves two other designs still unaccounted for. Could one or perhaps both of these designs be for the NX? It would make sense considering how close the console's release actually is, but as with all speculation, it's best to take that info with a pinch of salt. So then, the NX. We know we'll be playing Zelda on it at some point next year, but Nintendo are remaining tight-lipped about pretty much every other aspect of the console. Does this secrecy worry you, or are you buzzing off new console hype? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Goodbye! それと自分の身長より高いところから落ちたらもうガッて死んでたんですよ<笑>